Welcome to another Rolling with Phoenix Fans. Happy Thanksgiving week, y'all. Like, I'm out for Thanksgiving break. You know, the, you know, you know the big deal. But yeah, I get to relax for a week. But yeah. As you can tell by the title of the blog, why not get this Thanksgiving week going by by some throwback stories. Of course, this is new. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna tell tell a few things, kind of like a story, really, about what went down freshman year. But yeah, what went down freshman year? Oh my God, worst year. It's kind of like worst year in my life, really. But but yeah, listen. Here's what went down freshman year. Roll the intro. Alright, the story begins, but yeah, the start, uh, the story begins freshman year, like, it's my first year in high school, like, it's gonna, like, make new friends, like, you know, all that good stuff, well, I did make new friends, but, like, some... But there was some people who were like fake friends, like, like, dude, don't, 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 don't be, don't be friends with fake people. Like, well, of course, that was my mistake, being friends with fake people. But anyway, but yeah, it marks the start of my YouTube journey. Of course, I looked happy in one of these. One of these clips. Sorry. Of course, I looked happy in one of these clips. Like, well, behind that, like, when the camera's put down, I'm like sometimes not happy at all. So yeah, what happened is, was that um, you see. As you as you become a freshman, like some of these people, some like senior or junior girls start to like bait you into thinking they're really interested in you. Well, turns out they they like baiting you, man. Baiting with your feelings, like. But yeah, um. But yeah, like I looked happy on these vlogs, you know. You know, like. I mean, I'm starting my you, starting YouTube channel. Like, it's supposed to be exciting. Well, was at first, but turns out it wasn't. Well, I was always in desire for attention, and I'm, I believe some of you in high school, some of you that go to my school, will think that I'm still like that. Well, well, say what you want, whatever. But yeah, like um. Like, I would always dance at these pep rallies, and, and of course, like, be what you're in the background, but, but then, there you have some, but here comes the seniors. They start, like, they start, like, picking on me, like, some of them actually did become my friends, but, like, most of them, like, bro, fuck them. Fuck them. Like, uh, like this clip, like, I was in, um, sixth period class, like, in the library, and, um, the reason why I was in the library is because these seniors freaking in my actual sixth period class, like, um, they kept saying these stuff to me, like, like, bad stuff, like, I got so mad, like, I was nearly about to fight someone, like, damn the consequences, and, like, Bro, I'm finding someone. But yeah, it was like... Freshman year was like a series of toxic friendships that happened. Like... Most of this... Most of this happened, like... Like, during the second semester. Like, in the first semester of freshman year, it was actually really great, but... But... But then, um... 
then November comes. My grandfather passes away and and uh, I lost a part of myself. And um, but yeah, I lost a part of myself and and then from there, freshman year went downhill. It went downhill for me like a, it went and it ended like in a train wreck. Like, yeah, and in a train wreck. But yeah, like, things went wrong when my grandfather passes away. Because, because I lost a part of myself, I kind of became an asshole. Like, I thought I was better than everybody else, and... And, like, I wasn't really... I did not know how to be a nice person. And then, um, you see, I was gone that week, um, my grandfather died, like, I was gone that week when he died, um, I was, but yeah, I was gone for a week, um, and, you know, some people asked me, like, where I was, and I wouldn't answer, well, I didn't answer, I said I was in Mexico, but, like, I came back from Mexico, you know, some of my friends did welcome me back, and, um, but then I heard this rumor, somebody said that I got deported, and I'm like, I'm like, fucker, I'm literally from, I'm literally from Irving, I was born in Irving, I was born in the US, like, I'm not a freaking Mexican exchange student. Like, that's what really pissed me off. Because people thought I was getting the... People thought I got deported. That... I was really pissed off. But yeah, like... Imagine somebody telling you that. And you just came back from a trip because of a... A loved one passed away. But yeah. Someone you love passes away and then you come back... With people saying that you got deported, like, like that's messed up. And then one of these, one of these girls in this clip, like, they started. One of them said that I like get help me get a green card. I'm like, oh my god, like, that's what killed. Now, so. I can't believe I was like baited into like a bunch of like fake friendships, but like some like some people treat treated me like crap, and I just like bro, I just like I just let them get to me, like like in this clip. Justin is a bitch. <laughs> Just so I saw you at um, the park. But yeah, like, yeah, but yeah, right off the bat, um, but yeah, I became an asshole. Grandfather passed away, and then second semester starts. You see, this was, you see, my grandfather passed away in November, which was this month. And, um, like, two years ago now. But yeah, it was like this month. And... And you know, December goes by. I forgot how December went. Like, I do not remember a single thing. But yeah. Second semester starts. Start recording my first YouTube video. And, um, I did get some, like, subscribers out of it, but some people decided to go. Decided to give like, like give me shit. Like these, like they want. Some people decided to give me shit, and um, and I was like in a bad way. Like yeah, I did record like a video after, like a, a video of, after this, after this one, which was like the first video on my YouTube channel. I did record one where it was like me saying 
explaining how I became how I became interested in singing sorry I had to burp but 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 since since that day forward I, I recorded my second video that's when all hell broke loose Seniors treating me like crap, and juniors also picking on me, and I had a fu and I had a fight. Well, not not in like not in a physical fight. I got into like a fight with one of the, with a good friend of mine, and like all because the school changed my schedule, and we like started growing apart, and like. The year just ended bad, like, ended, like, that bad for me. I was, like, I was cons consumed by greed. I was greedy, like, I, like, tried, I, like, tried to get a girl, like, get a girlfriend, like, like, Oh my god, like, what was I thinking? What was wrong with me? Of course, everything was wrong with me. I was, like, bad way. Yeah, freshman year ended, and... Of course... It did not end well. Because it ended with me, like, making enemies, and... Like, I thought I was gonna make friends, but... No, turns out I made enemies. More enemies. And, um... Like, theater. My theater class, um... Actually, like... I had good friends in there, like... Like, it was Kendall, Ramiro... And, um... It was Lucas, Ryan, and Dee Dee. Of course, now Ryan's gone. Graduated last year, so did Ramiro. All I left was Kendall and uh, Dee Dee Lucas. But. But yeah, that's cool. That was like one of the classes that got changed. I'm sorry. I'm sort of like rambling all over the place, like just telling the story. It's not really a story, it's just saying what happened. But yeah, because I was really pissed off with everything, like I was having, I was going through so much stress. Like I went through so much stress that I did not want to film another vlog. I thought I was gonna get made fun of. Like, I was scared and kind of a wimp at the time. Like, I was, I was a bitch. I don't know what the hell happened. What was wrong with me? I don't know what the hell was wrong with me at the time, but like, dude. I know how to handle anything. I mean, I did not know how to handle things. I didn't look out for myself. The summer after freshman year, I was just, I just went through isolation. Like, I just stayed home and not go out in public because I did not want to talk to anybody. I didn't want to talk to a single soul. I just wanted to, like... We young people... I sound like an old dude just saying that. We're resilient like that. Like... Like, after a very bad, like, incident or anything... There comes resilience. You heal from it. Come back better than ever. And of course, freshman year, 
or I mean, then sophomore year started. But that is story for another day of how I story about what how sophomore year went. But yeah, that's a story for another day. Click the like button if you want to hear that. And. Bro, I see you. What the hell is that? Car, tractor. But yeah. Yeah, just you gotta be, you gotta learn how to be resilient. But yeah, after this vlog, I might tell a story about when I, during sophomore year, became a chambelan in the quinceanera. I even I have the clips of me dancing in the ball. But yeah, that's one of the stories of what happened freshman year. There's plenty more stories of what happened, but those are stories for another day because this video is already too long. But anyway, thanks for watching or listening, and that's it. Out of vlog. Hi. I'm just. What? Wait. What? You're what? Hold on. No, it's fine.